Hi everyone. We are continuing on with our Broker Bay training series. In this video, you will learn how to use the Broker Bay messaging tool. This tool is how you will receive messages, commonly referred to as pages, from the front desk staff. The nice thing about this tool in Broker Bay is that it turns the traditional paging process into a two-way chat. You can now receive messages from the front desk and other agents and easily reply all within Broker Bay. Let's take a look at how this works. The first thing you need to do is decide how you want to receive your messages. They will automatically be sent to the Broker Bay app, so you want to make sure you have that downloaded. If you haven't downloaded it yet, you can go back and watch our video on how to do that. You can also choose whether you want those messages sent to you via email, text, or both. Here's how you set that up. So you're gonna log into your Broker Bay account on your personal computer. And you're gonna to navigate to your top right corner where your picture is and click on notification settings. Once you're in this screen, you're gonna to navigate to the tab that says Office Messages. And from here, you're gonna focus on where it says Front Desk Messages. We can, it's automatically set to be sent to you via email. And you can now choose whether you wanna also have it sent via text, or maybe you just want it sent via text, or maybe you want it to go both. So you'll toggle those buttons to set your parameters. And once you have it the way you want it, you'll come over here and click Save. Now those parameters have been saved and the system will know how you wish to receive those messages. So let's take a look now at how the messaging tool actually works. So I'm gonna go back into my dashboard. So you're gonna log, you can actually use the messaging tool from your computer or from the app. Um, I'm going to show it to you from the computer perspective first, and then we'll take a look at what it looks like on the app. So from your computer, you're going to log into Broker Bay, and you're going to navigate to this blue circle with the white envelope. So you'll click that, and a window will pop up that says start a new conversation, choose who to message. So in the search bar, you're going to choose who you want to send a message to. It's automatically gonna have all of our agents in there as well as all of our admin staff. So you'll search them by name and when you find them, you'll cl click on the person and it puts them into the messaging tool. So that's who this message is gonna be sent to. The nice thing about this messaging tool is you can actually send it to more than one person at the same time. So let's say I also wanted to include Lori Roberts in this. I could search her, click on her name and add her into the chat as well. Once I have uh, the person in there that I wanna send the message to, I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna click send message. It will open up my chat box with the person who I'm sending the message to, their details at the top. And at the bottom, it's going to um, give me the space to actually write my message. So this is a test message. I'm gonna type it out. Before I send it off, I wanna show you one other quick thing here. <clears throat> Another really cool part of this messaging tool is that you can actually add attachments to your messages. So let's say you had a listing loaded and you wanted to add another picture. You want the front desk to upload a new uh, photo onto your listing. You can actually go in through this messaging tool and attach that picture and send a message off saying, here's an extra picture for 123 Main Street, and it'll be attached and sent right to them. There's also the ability to delay your message. So you can go in and choose the date and time you want this particular message to be sent. So a couple of added features there. Okay, so I'm going to send this message to myself, and then I'm going to show you how it looks when you receive it on your smart device. So I'm just going to click enter, and the message is sent. And you can hear the notifications going off on my phone. 
So this is how it looks when it's received on your phone. So I have my text message notification and my broker bay um, notification right on my home screen. I have my phone set to not receive emails on my home screen. So that's why you're not seeing the email portion of it there. When I go into my Broker Bay app, let's say I want to read the message directly in my Broker Bay app. I open up my Broker Bay app. This is the screen that it takes me to, my dashboard. And you're going to navigate right to the bottom where you see the chat box or the chat, um, chat icon. And it'll show you how many unread messages you have. So you're going to click on that. And then it will bring you into your messaging window. So it'll show you all the messages that you've um, previously sent and received. The most recent message is gonna be right up at the top. You also have the ability to toggle into just your unread messages. So you can see exactly which ones you haven't read. So if I wanna open my most recent message, I just simply click on it and it brings me into an individual chat session with that person. So it shows me the message that was sent. And if there was any attachments sent, I can open them from here as well. If I wanna to respond to this message, all I have to do is click in this write a message here box and uh, type in my message and click send and it will send back to Phil. So if I wanna say thanks for sending that, I just send clicks or type out thanks for sending, click send and Phil will get it. So that's how it's gonna look in the Broker Bay app. This is how it will look when you receive it as a text message. So it's going to say office message. It will tell you what the message is. And then if, you've at, if attachments have been added, they will be listed there as a link that you can open. It also shows you how to reply if it comes via text. So when you click this link, it's actually gonna open you back up into your Broker Bay app. So replying to messages on the go has to be done through the Broker Bay app. This is how it looks if you have it set to um, send to you via email. So this is what it will look like in your emails, um, test sending an attachment, the message is there. And again, you can click the link to open it. To respond again, you're gonna wanna go back, navigate back into that Broker Bay app to respond to that message. So that's receiving messages through the Broker Bay app and, and sending mess, or sorry, through, the, um, through the, the PC version. So now I'm gonna show you how you can send a message uh, in the app. So this is your dashboard on the app. You're gonna navigate to that chat bubble right at the bottom of your screen. Click that, then you're gonna click the blue button at the bottom. Then it will show you your start a conversation screen. So you can search for the person that you would like to start a conversation with and it automatically defaults you into people from your brokerage. You can click in to recent people that you've had chats with. And this is a really cool feature where you can actually search all agents who are part of the Broker Bay program. So this is agents from different brokerages. So any brokerage that is using Broker Bay, their agents will be listed in this part. Um, and you can actually search that agent and start a chat conversation with them right within Broker Bay. So you'll click your search button and you'll type in the person's name and search them who you wanna send the message to. It'll find the person. So if I want to send a message to Phil, it'll find him and I click his name and click the button down here to send him a message. It takes me into a new conversation screen or a new chat screen. And again, I simply type my message here. Then I can click send. And that's it, it's as simple as that. So that's how you can send and receive messages using the Broker Bay messaging tool. One last thing I wanna show you about the messaging 
is you do also have the ability to search for previous messages that have been sent to you. So let's say you need to find a, um, a previous appointment confirmation, maybe it accidentally got deleted off your phone um, or any kind of message that you know somehow went missing and you need to find it again. So you are able to search through all of your previous chats. The way you do that is you're gonna log into your broker bay on your computer. You'll go to this chat bubble up here and it will automatically show you your most recent messages. If you click see all at the bottom, it takes you into all of your messages that have been sent and received. And then you have the ability to um, search keywords, a name, anything like that in this part, and you can select dates if you need to. You can also export your messages by clicking this export button here. So I'll just quickly show you how to search in your app um, for your messages. So when you um, go into your uh, app, you're gonna click on this chat bubble. And then right up here, you're gonna have this little search tool. So you just simply click that. And again, you type in keywords and it will help you find whatever message you're looking for. So that is the messaging tool or the chat function in Broker Bay. Um, if you have any questions at all about how to use this or how to set up your notifications, please reach out to us at the front desk or any one of the managers and we'd be happy to help you. Thanks very much for watching. Hope you have a great day.